For full episodes of the Diverse Mentality Podcast, check the links in the description below. The full video version is available on the main channel, and the audio version is available on your favorite streaming platforms such as Spotify, Apple Podcasts, and more. Lil Dirk. Dirkio. He's been killing it, obviously. I mean, musically. Everything's been popping off for him. Dirk. Uh, Lil Dirk vows to stop rapping about the dead after reflecting on King Von and Brother D thing. Now, he said this before, so I don't know how serious he is, but I hope he's serious because, I don't know, man, rap about dead people and just, like, laughing about them dying, like, I don't know. It's really stupid. Yeah, man. Smoking on the Tuca, who I smoke, like, all these. Yeah, no. This is, like, chill, it's entertaining music. Don't get me no. wrong. <laughs> it is entertaining. The music is good. Don't get me wrong. The music is good. Right, right. Some gangs of shit, but... I don't know, man. It's, I've, something sits wrong with me pumping that type of music. Nobody gives a fuck anymore. Yeah, it's really fucked up. It's like you have to do you have to do more crazier things to get attention. So now it's like, what can we do to like make people whoa? Like, yeah, because you're already seen pretty much all. So, uh, going to the article. Growing up on the South Side of Chicago, Lil Durk has suffered through numerous tragic losses in his life while on the road to stardom as a rapper. Durkio was often name dropped the dead in lyrics throughout his career, but after some deep reflecting on losing. Those closest to him, such as his brother D thing and protege King Vaughn, he won't be doing it any longer on tracks or while performing. Um, he said in the tweet, I'm not mentioning the dead in my songs no more or performing songs with their name in it. Uh, Vaughn left us, D thing left us, and I was lost. I'm done name dropping the dead after my deluxe and only in my songs, though. So um, that's what he said, though. Like that's, that's what I'm saying. He said this in January 2021. He said, I'm I'm done name dropping after my deluxe. Only in the songs, though. But now he's saying he's not going to do it at all. So we'll see. It's I probably guess. done, done. We'll see. I mean, you would think after all these losses and shit. That yeah, I mean, he's been going to, to, through too much. So it's. Jeez, this guy, this guy has somebody <laughs> yeah, that man. dies like every six months. It's yeah. fucking crazy, man. I know. Like, I'm. That's <laughs> tough, man. Yeah, he's been dealing with drugs and all kinds of shit. Mentally, it, it definitely fucks you up. That's not. But hopefully all rappers really stop mentioning dead people, man. Yeah, Especially yeah. Tuca. Tuca's like 14, 15 years old, and there's songs about him. Yeah. Like, Tuca, come on, man. That, kid, that guy's a kid. Like, why are we rapping about smoking Tuca? And just, it's really stupid, man. A lot it's of a shit. respectful thing, like, to not just talk about mm. dead people. I mean, it's the streets. Like, you they know, don't really give a fuck. At this yeah, point. I know, but it's like, come on, man. Yeah. Respect the dead. Yeah, at this point. So, 